An electrical fire overnight nearly destroyed a flower shop in downtown Forsyth. Epicosaurus talked to the owners and the people in the community who say they will come together to get the business repaired. It was always filled with flowers. It's like the brightest spot on the square and every time you would drive past or even walk, there was always the bright colors out in the windows. But those bright flower arrangements are gone. After an electrical fire that broke out in the back of the shop on Tuesday morning, left all of the flowers and equipment destroyed. The damage is pretty severe this time, so it's going to take probably four to six months to rebuild. Mike Ellis owns the business and his wife Angie runs the shop, but it's meant a lot to them to give back to the community. We delivered balloons and flowers to mamas that had babies that now that we're delivering wedding flowers to those babies. so. It's certainly something to enjoy. I'm pretty sure the community will help in some sort of way to help with this. Erica Martin works at the pickled okra down the street, but she remembers the last time she was at Flowers by Helen. It was with her mom. And right there was a, an arrangement of magnolias, and we just stopped, looked at each other, and went, perfect, that's it. Martin says the flowers made her mom feel special on her wedding day, and she's sad she won't be able to go back for a while. Kroger or Publix, you know, they always have those beautiful, you know, flower arrangements, but you would never have thought about a local flower shop like that that's still in business. Mike and Angie Ellis say that they have plans to move to a temporary location because not even a fire can stop them from filling orders for Mother's Day in prom. In Forsyth, Abby Casaurus, 13 WMAZ Eyewitness News.